Hey guys, it's Gary, also known as Mr. Techie Gaming, here on YouTube, and welcome back to Let's Play Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets on the Nintendo GameCube. In the last video, we lost against Slytherin at the Quidditch Stadium, and we defeated the Spider, also known as Aragog, or something along those lines. And in this video, I think it's going to get exciting. <sighs> exciting? End of day, woo. Gryffindor. Hufflepuff. Ravenclaw. Slytherin. Good news is, guys, we are actually still ahead on house points, which is absolutely amazing. And, uh, yeah, it's now the night mission, and it's going to get exciting. So let's go speak to Ron, whoever's here. Where were you, Ron? I've been to McGonagall's office, and then I had to go to see Hermione. McGonagall told me that Ginny's gone missing. They can't find her anywhere. When it gets worse... It's Hermione. She was attacked. She's been petrified. Huh? They found her just like nearly headless Nick, outside moaning myrtles. Steph is aboard! McGonagall told me that they were doing everything they could to find Ginny. So, I went to see Hermione. I found a piece of paper in her hand. A page torn from an old library book. That must have been what she was doing before she was attacked. What was the page about? It was all about basilisks. They're giant snakes that live for hundreds of years. Apparently, a basilisk can kill people by just staring at them. Anything else? Yeah, spiders don't like them. They run away when a basilisk is near. And there was something else. Hermione had written the word pipes on the page. Pipes? Pipes. That's all, just pipes. Ron, this is it. This is the answer. The monster in the Chamber of Secrets is a basilisk. A giant snake. That's why I've been hearing the voice and nobody else has heard it. It's because I understand parcel tongue. Harry, do you think Ginny might be in the Chamber of Secrets along with that flipping big snake? McGonagall said they searched everywhere in the castle, but no one knows where the chamber is. We've got to find her. OK, so what we need to know is how the basilisk's been getting round the place. A giant snake. Surely someone would have seen it. Pipes! Pipes, Ron! It's been using the plumbing. I've been hearing the voice inside the walls. The entrance to the Chamber of Secrets. What if it's a bathroom? What if it's in... Moaning Myrtle's bathroom! OK. So what do we do? The place is crawling with prefects looking for Ginny. I'll go first. You join me in Moaning Myrtle's on the second floor. Ooh. It's all... It's all coming together now. So we're now walking backwards. Because why the heck not? And apparently the place is crawling with prefects. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I don't think there's any prefects on the way there. And I so nearly got hit by two ghosts. So we're gonna go to the second floor. Moly Moot's bathroom. It's gonna be a fun time. So yeah, let's do this thing. Wait for the lovely staircase to load. Ooh, guys, it's going to kick off now. Oh, it's you, Harry Potter. What do you want this time? To ask how you died. Oh, it was dreadful. It happened right here. I'd hidden because Olive Hornby was teasing me about my glasses. I was crying when I heard someone come in. It was a boy, and he began speaking a different language. To tell him to go to use his own bathroom, and then I died. But how? I just remember seeing these great big eyes. Where exactly did you see the eyes? Over there, by the sinks. Harry, say something! Something in parcel tongue! But go on, Harry. Okay then. Uh, open up. English. I'm going down there!
Oh, I must be miles under the school. Ooh, a nice little save point. Uh, I just suddenly realised I didn't actually refill my potion vials, but I have a feeling. Um, okay, I don't think you can. I thought you could refill your potion valve, but apparently not. Ah well, I'll live. Ginny? She won't wait. Tom? Tom Riddle? She's still alive, but only just. You've got to help me, Tom! We've got to get her out of here! There's a basilisk and it could be along at any moment! The Basilisk won't come until it's called. Let me tell you about the real reason Ginny's like this. She's been writing in the diary. My diary for months. I grew stronger and stronger on a diet of her deepest fears until I had enough power to start pouring a little of my soul back into her. What do you mean? Ginny Weasley opened the Chamber of Secrets. She daubed threatening messages on the walls and set the Serpent of Slytherin on the mudbloods and nearly had this nick. No! I'm afraid so. Ginny told me all about you, Harry. So I decided to show you my famous capture of that great oaf, Hagrid, to gain your trust. You brained Hagrid! Yes. But you, Harry Potter, how is it that you managed to defeat the greatest wizard of all time? Why do you care? Haven't you realised yet? I am Lord Voldemort, the greatest sorcerer in the world. Sorry to disappoint you in all that, but the greatest sorcerer in the world is Albus Dumbledore. Dumbledore's been driven out of Hogwarts by the mere memory of me. He's not as gone as you might think! To business, Harry. I'm going to teach you a little lesson. Let's match the powers of Lord Voldemort, heir of Salazar Slytherin, against the famous Harry Potter. Kill him! Hey guys, so the Basilisk oh, part of the game so. has begun. Begun, everyone would like to say. And the epic music has also started, so we have to kill the Basilisk. Forks is epic, he blinded. Kill him. Don't kill me. Ah well, I lost a beam and an elf, but you know. Yes, we're doing damage! Woohoo! I remembered how to do it now. Let's pick up the sword. Run away! Forks drops, um... Some health items, I believe, like, um, pumpkin pasties and the like. If you follow him enough. Oh no. Oh no. No no. Don't kill me. He just basically squirts green goo at you. To which you wait for him to stop targeting when that light thing happens and press X because that's your sword button. And you slowly hit him. And then your sword goes flying away, which you then have to go pick up again, which is, you know, a bit annoying, but you know. Basically, this part is easier than the spider part, and if you got to this part, then you must have done the spider part, and therefore, you can do this. Die, so this Harry thing, Potter. this thing's a bit stupid, but ah well. We won't question it. At least the... At least the chamber is kind of somewhat accurately represented. It's not completely wrong. Yay! Die! Woo! We're killing him! Where's the sword? Hey, hey look, it's a pumpkin pasty! That's nice. 
didn't fully get our health up, but it's helped. I don't think we're going to die anytime soon, to be fair. If there is more, I can't remember if there is more after we get it down the first time, then I don't see us dying, to be fair. Ginny is dying, Harry. Ginny is dying. No, she's not. I'm just about to save her. It's fine. Basically, uh, the, the the further his health goes down, the more blue he squirts you before doing the whole white light thing that all the enemies, all the bosses seem to do in this game. It always means you've got to sort of cast some kind of spell at them, but in this, this part, you, I don't know what you do. Apparently this is like a magical sword in this game, and it sort of shoots out the magicalness. Which kills them. I don't actually know what, what goes on. You don't hit them with the sword like happens in the book in the real film, and probably the book. I haven't really read it, but yeah. By the way, guys, sorry if my voice is a bit bad today. Yeah. Oh well. Got to make videos. Yes, there is. Move out the way when he squirts green goo and hit him with magicalness of my sword when his white light appears, showing that he can clearly take hit damage. I don't actually know what this whole white sword thing's all about. Oh, he hit me. Ah oh, well. And again. I can do it. Oh! Epic moment! Are we going to do it? No. Apparently not. I could now do with a pumpkin pasty. Ah, golden cake. Thanks for that. A random falling cauldron cake. Dumbledore has deserted you, Harry. Well, not really. Um, Forks is here. And Forks gave me a sword and blinded him so he wouldn't kill me. And, you know, For Forks is a legend, and Dumbledore would have done something if he could. Plus, it's my fault, I decided to go in the Chamber of Secrets, to be fair. <laughs> Epic moment! Disappointed. With all that's happened, Professor McGonagall has cancelled this year's exams. I was really looking forward to doing all of that revision. As you can see, Harry, Hermione's made a complete recovery. Anyway, did you know that the House Cup is about to be awarded? The presentation's in the Great Hall. Yeah, I hope we've got enough house points to beat Slytherin. I'd really love to see Malfoy's face if we managed to do it two years in a row. Well, when you're ready, Harry, we'll go in. Well, I am going to end this video here. The next video, we're going to at least start, maybe finish, all of the extra stuff, getting all the wizard cards and etc. So, yeah, great things to come. If you did enjoy this video, please go ahead and like and add to favorites. Also, subscribe to me down below. It'd be absolutely incredible. It helps me out loads. And you get to see when I upload new videos like this. You can also follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Google Plus. Links to all that and more in the description box below and yeah I will see you very soon guys so goodbye <laughs>